Hi, it's Maxine Kay with the Greater Philadelphia Center for Spiritual Living with a love note. Oh gosh, just came off a wonderful Zoom class that Bo and I are teaching on the Essential Earnest Homes. What beautiful material, what a great, great book, and what a marvelous class. Oh my gosh, we have nothing but brilliant, heart-opened, mind-blowing students, and we're so grateful. One of the things that we were focusing on tonight, one of the readings, was about listening. And it reminded me that somebody once said, some people just need a good listening to. <laughs> and I agree. I think we do too much talking and not enough listening. And I mean real listening. Not the kind of listening is uh-huh, uh-huh, while well, someone is speaking, and then we already have our minds made up about what we're going to say next, or about some good advice we're going to give them. No, that's not listening. Listening, first of all, as I know it, is listening deeply to the voice of spirit within us, on which we can always depend. That wonderful sense of the wise knowing within, that always guides us in the right way when we open our hearts and listen with the ear of the heart. That sweet, sweet voice of spirit upon which we can always depend, which always guides us to make the right decisions, to move in the right direction, and simply to feel the loving presence within and all around us. That deep listening is first thing. It is then, as we fill up with the presence, that it becomes not only easy, but delightful to open our hearts and listen to other people, to be patient, to be compassionate, truly to hold them tenderly while we're listening to what they're sharing. It's a beautiful thing. You know, it's been said that what, uh, what we do, they may not remember. What we say, they may not remember but how we make them feel, they'll remember. And how much more loving can it be? How much more supportive and honoring can it be than truly to listen with an open heart to what another person wishes to share with us? It's such a beautiful gift. Let's listen. Listen to the voice of spirit within. Listen to those around us with our heart open loving them, seeing the divine within them, and knowing there's always a solution if they're presenting a challenge. And there's always a way if they're talking about something exciting they'd like to do. I want to listen to you, not just talk to you. <laughs> we'll be together soon. We love you very much. All is well. Thanks for tuning in.